truck. Damn it, boy. Time has come to start to pull this bad boy out. Starting to disassemble this thing. Definitely gonna take me a little bit of time with all this extra stuff. We'll move right along here. She is gutted. So what's up ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode. I know it's been a little while since the last update, just had a bunch of stuff going on. Just really been trying to get everything taken care of, pull everything out of this hatch so we can transfer it over to Charlie's car here. You can see I've got the K24 mount over here, uh, as well as this one. I've got the engine over here with the transmission separated, and I've got the transmission pulled apart, and it had a problem with second gear, and if you can notice right here, those teeth on the gear are sheared off. We've ordered a new second gear, synchro and selector. The hub looks good. So I've got to wait on those parts to get here before I can fix the transmission, put that back together and then put it with uh, the engine and get ready to swap everything into Charlie's car. So there really hasn't been much, you know, progress, just been waiting on stuff and parts. Looks like it's gonna rain. Now it's taken me a couple days to get everything dialed in with uh, my setup. It is finally working tip top. I had the AC charged, the AC works beautifully i had to replace the two relays that go here and i've still got to finish tucking the wires i needed to make sure that everything was working properly before i kind of tuck and hide the wires and then i've got to get a uh, a better setup for the coolant reservoir um it's just kind of hanging there at the moment but uh, i've been battling just a couple of coolant leaks here and there but it, it seems like everything's kind of buttoned up and everything is tip top probably take a ride in this thing it definitely is quicker for sure. It's got bigger cams, a little more horsepower, has the RBC manifold, and I definitely plan on getting it tuned later, but the way it runs now, it runs pretty darn good. Uh, the transmission is shorter, and so that helps with the acceleration. But right now the car is filthy, so I need to really get this thing cleaned up. It's absolutely dirty. Everybody wants to know, where's it at? Where's the V6? We hit a thousand likes. Why aren't we running? Look, John's scared. John's scared of the kid. Right. I'm so scared. <laughs> so much for a drive. 